when do you guys want to have kids? By the way, love your channel. Thank you. Um, when do we want to have kids? Kiss? Kids. Kids. Yeah. Kids. You're driving. So, do you want to respond? Do you want to respond this one? Yeah. When we were engaged, we talked about waiting a couple of years after we got married to start having kids, and that's still the case now. We are about to hit our one year mark in March wow, and actually, that is crazy. We'll have one right year of marriage already. So that's crazy how fast time flies and the reason why we wanted to wait a couple years is because we wanted some time for ourselves first before starting a family because once you have kids, as many of you know, they are the priority at that point and you know everything is about them. And wanted to have this time just for ourselves and to travel and like just us first and live together first before adding kiddos to the mix and just having making sure we have a good solid foundation beforehand and I think that's worked out really good for us. And all power to you if you know if you're doing both things at the same time because yeah. we have a puppy and <laughs> he's not easy and he's just a puppy that yeah. you know goes to sleep with us or and he's a, a good night. puppy he's a good too. puppy he's, he's so, but, he's, but he's a handful so yeah it's a lot of responsibility which is one of the reasons why we decided to get a puppy um, in our first year just to you know we love dogs and we always wanted to have a um, pet he's our son yeah he's oh I love him um, we haven't but, posted a Rex video no we haven't he's huge it just teaches us responsibility and how to work with each other and how to have each other's backs. So we're we're 600 feet away, which is a lot of feet from our turn, and then we're almost gonna be at our destination. Yeah. It's been a lot of driving for you. I was gonna say like you've been just chilling, <laughs> singing, and listening to Taylor Swift, <laughs> roasting me. We've had a good car sing along all the way from Taylor Swift to System oldies. Up and down. Like Lincoln Park to John Legend. John Legend. But Bunny but 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 No, but, we don't listen but, to but, that. But, but, but. And now we are almost there. Should we say like kinda like the place that we're or like uh Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> that was kinda gross. It sounded like you were eating a cookie or something like the cookie monster. <laughs> In 1,000 feet. That's turn a right, lot of feet. Left, Gosh. <laughs> Why can't you just have like centimeters? Centimeters. That would be a lot of centimeters. <laughs> but why feet? Centimeters. It's like Crossy Road. Mm. We're here. I'm kind of nervous. Mm. Because this is an Airbnb and I've never... It's We've our never very, tried. very first experience. Yes. And we wanted to try it because it's got great reviews. So... Looks Wish like a cute luck. little house. What's up? Uh, what's up? Uh, what? Oops. Okay. What's up, uh, guys? Woo. So, full of energy, have breakfast. Priscilla is still awake. I mean, asleep, but we'll get cheap. But the important finish. part of this, guys, if you take anything out of today, make sure if you're staying with your girl that the first thing you do in the morning, do not say hi, do not hug her. Make sure the first thing you do in the morning is feed her. Please. It will avoid conflicts. It will I make a happy even life. That I didn't you know why? Because the first thing we did was eat breakfast. I'm just saying, like out of experience, out of experience, I know that the first thing we do in the morning is eat because I don't know where my wife goes in the morning. Like she just disappears and then after she eats, it's like, I'm back. <laughs> Hi babe. You're so cute. So oh my god, you make it sound like it's like so it much is more intense than it no, is. No, that's exactly how it is. No. You guys don't know Priscilla. No. You guys don't know her. <laughs> no. Are you nervous? Is that oh. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, we're on our way to um, Everglades airboat ride. So we go into a swamp. And hopefully not get eaten by alligators. Where there's a bunch of alligators, of alligators and apparently it's an amazing experience. Um so we're gonna we're gonna try it out. We'll record it for you guys. Apologize. Yesterday we did not vlog at all, other other than in the car. Yeah. So on our way.
went like, back. It was good because we kind of had like time for ourselves and just put away the phone. And then today's like our more adventurous day. IKEA. Uh -huh. <laughs> this should be a fun experience, highly rated for around this area. So we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna head to our next destination, our hotel. And uh, then we're gonna go to the beach. Stay tuned, feed your girls. First day in the morning, like I guess <laughs> I know what it is, man. Just don't, don't ask me. Cause I don't know the answer. You just feed her. That's what you do. You're trying to look cute for the alligators? Is that it? No, I'm not trying you're gonna to look be cute like, for the alligators. I'm trying to look cute for myself. Nah. And they're gonna, you. they're gonna look at you. They're gonna say, "Yo, girl, did it hurt when you fell from the vending machine? Cause you've been looking like a snack." <laughs> <laughs> That's what the alligator's gonna, gonna say. say that. Yep. Cause dude, he look like a snack. He's just gonna pull his face out, pull out of my. He's like, yo, bro. Did it hurt? When? When you when you fell from the vending machine? Cause you've been looking like a snack, girl. A swamp, a big old swamp. <laughs> a big old swamp. Uh, we don't know what to expect, but he looked like fun. Oh, it looked like fun. Welcome to the Florida Everglades. Parking to the right. Oh, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you, man? What's wrong, what's wrong with you? So, you know, as you guys know, Priscilla works at a uh, plastic surgery place, and she says she's gonna get my lips done. Like, uh -uh. I'm gonna be talking like this. Got one. Beautiful lips. What up, man? You don't need, get, what's up, give me that. bro? Give me that. Can I sit in the middle? No. I'm sitting in the middle. I'm gonna leave you in a little corner where all the alligators can see how much of a snack you are. Thumbs up this video if you are a victim of if you love us. heavy purse syndrome due to your husband and or boyfriend and or and okay, or. or boyfriend um, gives you the keys, the wallet, the phone, the everything. But I love them. So we've already checked in and we just went back to the car to get the camera. They give us these little um, earplugs, I guess super loud there because the motor is in the back boom, boom. anyway so we're getting the camera there are a lot of people a lot here of, a lot of people to eat besides us that's comforting what are you most excited about being on the boat or seeing alligators um i don't know i think the alligators yeah yeah i'm more excited about being on the boat just going through feeling the wind through my Hair and you know, just enjoying a nice time. What are you learning? I'm really I. I'm okay seeing the alligators. I just don't want to see them that close. I don't know how close they'll be, so that kind of scares me. Let's go. Cause they're fam. fast. They go like this. They don't go. They don't go like that. If an alligator went like that through life, it would never hunt and catch anything. It would never catch anything to eat. <laughs> so I saw a video of an alligator that, all right, so there was, there was, a, I guess, an alligator exhibit. And then they threw like a bunch of food to the alligators. And one of them grabbed the other alligator's arm, thinking it was the food. And then he rotated like really fast and broke it up. Oh my gosh. So. And the other alligator was like, bro, what you do that for? But like I think he didn't even, accident, he didn't right? even show pain. He was just like, eh. oh, I don't think. What did you expect them to do right. if they feel pain get and like mad. get mad and like try to? Okay. But no, he just cut his arm off and he just looks at him like, bro, like, why? <laughs> that was messed up. Yeah, like that's messed up, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So we are getting ready to go into our airboat ride into the swampiness of all the swamps. Swampiness of all the swamps. Of all the swamps. So this is kind of what we're going into.
<laughs> Guys, if we don't make it, we love you all. He keeps trying to flip the switches. It's not turning on. SOS, send help. Somebody come our way. We hear a boat in the distance. Maybe they're coming to our rescue. No one did not expect this at all. There's here in the help. So they said it could be a full grown female or a growing male. Yeah, he's basically popping out his chest. Okay, so we got off the boat ride, we have like a little area here that we're going to the reptile and wildlife exhibit. I throw it in there, we didn't have any. Do you want one for you, baby? They kind of look like dinosaurs. Yeah, do you want one? Thank you. Can I hold them? Hold them, come on. Okay, if I can. What do I hold for? You gotta use your whole hand, though, okay? Not just two. Okay, okay. You've just been out like a And then all the way up under the arms. And then with this hand, you don't want to squeeze, okay? Pretend like you're happy. Oh, God. All right, let me take it. Yeah, it is a video. Okay, I'm getting it. You guys want to hop in down right after this? family. Whoa, well, this is a python. Let's see the other The other snake. one you can't really see it. Look yeah, at the blue. Wow. Smallest member of the fox family. Two, hmm. two and a half pounds is it. She's she's 11 years old. This is a bobcat. Oh my god, there's a leopard. So crazy just seeing it. I have never seen an animal just eat like that in real life. I've just seen them like at Disney and the safaris just running around, but never like this. Oh my gosh, it's so leopard. Look at his eyes. Yo! Wow, my hair is a mess. We're back on the road. We're heading over to our hotel. The next stop after that is going to be maybe the beach. Maybe we'll hit the pool. Hit the pool. Yeah. <laughs> hit the pool. Punch just hit it. Just hit it one time. In the neck. <laughs> in the neck. Hit in the, the balls. Right in the balls. Okay. All right. <laughs> that was a cool experience, wasn't it? I love it. The whole. Oh, I got a sunburn. Look at that. Oh, that's no wonder. Oh my goodness. I just realized this. <gasps> Yourself, girl? I got a sunburn, but only on one shoulder. Well, a little bit on this one, but this side is more than the other because we were stuck for a while in the boat before they got us, and the sun was consistently well, hitting. What happened. Okay, okay I think we. Well, I think they they probably already saw, right? Okay. okay. <laughs> Look at this arm. Shrimp. A little sharp. You see my finger? I guess uh -huh. Ah! Okay. <laughs> I don't know if you guys really could understand or hear us in the last few clips, but we got stuck in the boat because some technical difficulty. I'm not sure if they ran the out of gas or what, but the engine wasn't working and the guy did pretty much everything to try to fix it and then they had to get a um, backup. <laughs> For those of you who never heard this before, you will be hearing it a lot because that's my our Rexy our Rexy pants dance and our dance. Yeah. We've just invented that's it. Our and we just started dance. like. So imagine our, our bucks are just like. And when we get home, his tail's like wagging and his hips are moving like side to side. He has like a butt wiggle. So then he starts doing that. And it's hilarious because it's like he's like dancing along to it. Oh, anyway, so we got stuck on this boat for quite some time. I got some burn on mainly this part of my body because I was the sun was like literally right here. And they finally got another guy to come and rescue us. And then we had to hop from one boat to the next. Like we, they just held it together. They just 
hopped on. Um, we're not going back to where we already checked out, so we're going to a different place. And this one is not an Airbnb, it's just a hotel. Alright, bye. <laughs> Right now, it's making noise, so a little um, thing, maybe a uh, swing. We're sitting on a little swing right now, it's making a lot of noise. And Johnny has a song for you guys. <laughs> um, oh, do you see my sunburn? Look at that. Oh, it's so bad. It hurts. What's up, guys? What's up, guys? We just got back to Orlando. Uh, we are like five minutes away from, uh, from seeing our puppy. Can't wait to pick him up. Yeah. I want to squeeze him. Probably just a little quick update. We didn't record anything last night or this morning, but basically we stayed in uh, last night. And because um, we had a pretty, pretty long day, we were pretty tired. And then this morning just woke up, we had everything ready and ate breakfast and head this way because we kind of wanted to get out here around the Orlando area pretty um pretty early because pretty we early. To work tomorrow so we wanted to just chill home and spend time with our puppy but we're back and uh we're gonna pick him up and I just know it when we open the door Priscilla's got this awkward it's sunburn gonna have an awkward sunburn look at this Looks like I'll bet that Rex is gonna like I know how he's gonna react. He's gonna be wiggling his butt from side to side. He's gonna be wagging his cute little tail and he's gonna lose it when he sees us. Yeah, oh, we've missed him. Anyway, all right. <sighs> you can't stretch so... without making a noise. You guys know this. <laughs> She's, she like she tells me that why do you have to make the noises? I was like you can't you get so you can't get a successful stretch successful if you don't stretch. if you don't just like scream it out your lungs. Okay. But she doesn't know that clearly. She's never had a, had a successful stretch <laughs> in her life. I have. Nope. Baby. 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 Oh, oh, you've been playing? Have you been playing? Have you been playing? <laughs> okay, guys, so we didn't film an outro to the video. Yeah, this is like two weeks this later. Is, no, this <laughs> is like the next month. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So I just wanted to let you guys know that we're extremely thankful for you guys tuning in. Thank you. And we hope we enjoyed come. it. Exactly. We're actually in Georgia today, so we're going to be filming a video on the way back. You're going to be filming a video on the way back? I oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. It'll probably come out in another two months or so. No, it won't. <laughs> we're not going to let that happen. Right? I mean, you tell me. Just want to let you guys know <laughs> that we're thankful for you guys watching. We actually posted this video tonight. So if you're tuned in, I, we appreciate you. Thank you for the support, and there is more to come. See you later. Bye. Wait, did, did you it stop?